All right, YouTube, I wanted to do a video today. Uh, I promised that I would do some Linux gaming videos. I'm gonna start getting into my Steam library and showing off some titles that you would normally play in Windows on Linux, uh, but I thought it would be fun to do something a little bit different to kick it off. Kind of wanted to show how flexible this can be, uh, depending on your, your perspective. Uh, so before I installed the, uh, Fedora 35, I think for uh, a while I had a mechanical hard drive just kind of chilling on, in my computer that I was just dumping games and stuff onto, but I since upgraded to a better storage solution for my mass storage, and I hadn't really gotten around to um, reinstalling uh, the Wii U emulator. Uh, so we're going to play some Breath of the Wild today. I have this running through Lutris. Um, CEMU is an emulator that's uh, meant to be run on Windows, but I think it's kind of trippy that you can run a Windows-based emulator to emulate Wii U games and then run that on top of Wine. So it's like you've got like an inception kind of thing of gaming going on that I think is kind of interesting and demonstrative of the point that you actually can do really a lot um, insofar as getting games to run on Linux. So. Uh, I've used Lutris to install the uh, emulator here. Uh, Lutris is like a game manager uh, kind of launcher that helps you uh, install games. Um, other users put together these install scripts that sort of automates um, the process. This takes a lot of the uh, troubleshooting out of it. Uh, it's really useful, especially for getting non-Steam titles to run. Um, I've got World of Warcraft here that launches with the Blizzard launcher, and I've got the Epic Game Store that I've used before not using it right now. Um, you can grab uh, Lutris from your, your software center. Generally just search Lutris, you could grab it there. Um, I just get it as part of the uh, RPM uh, Fedora repositories. It's probably available in almost any distribution nowadays anyway. Um, if you don't have it in your software center, you're not sure how to get it. Uh, Lutris's website has a pretty good explanation of what you need to do on pretty much any any distribution. So uh, yeah, CEMU you can just start it up. I've got some games here: Super Mario 3D World, uh, Super Smash Brothers. Got some Legend of Zelda games. Uh, I'm gonna switch over into window captured mode and launch this game up so you guys can see what kind of performance I get. All right, switch to Windows Capture, launched uh, the game. Um, if you're running Linux, uh, you can get, install a CEMU, uh, or I don't even know how you say it, CEMU uh, through Lutris. Um, there is a tool called Wii USB Helper that you can use to actually get the games. Um, that is a Windows only tool. So what I've done is uh, I actually usually just like fire up a virtual machine uh, with Windows on it, download uh, those games, and then copy them over into the directory where I have um, the uh, emulator installed that works for me. If you have like an old crappy laptop laying around, I guess you could probably get them that way too and just transfer them over. It's, it's not that difficult to do. Uh, okay, I guess we can hit continue. That was about right here, right before it gets all scenic. <laughs> I just started a new game because it'd been like it's been like two years since I played this, so I don't even remember how the hell to play it. <laughs> the Shrine of Resurrection. Okay. Other way. Other way. Hold the Sheikah slate up to the pedestal. That will show you the way. Pretty good so far. This is cool. It was a little choppy when it first started, but uh, you know. I think I didn't have the window focus, that's probably why. Link, you are the light. Our light. That must shine upon us. Go Hyrule towards once the again. light, Link. Now go. Uh, this is running at uh, 1440p, like 60 frames per second. I've got some uh, graphics mods on it. 
Uh, it looks really good. <laughs> uh, this is a Logitech F710, um, works in Linux. The uh, receiver is kind of crap though, like if you have it underneath something or just sort of out of line of sight, it, it doesn't work so great. Dick. Um, so I don't actually have a complete shader cache, so as I'm playing, um, I'm compiling shaders. Uh, this has improved so much on uh, CMU in the last uh, few years. Um, with Vulkan now, it's almost it's almost so fast that you don't need a pre-compiled shader cache. Dick. This is running really good. Um, I've run this in both Windows and Linux. Uh, the performance is about the same. Thanks, man. Let's go bash something on the head. Get some apples. Cause a ruckus. See what I mean? I haven't played this in years. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I like them apples, huh? Marked on the map in your Sheikah slate. I wouldn't say that setting this up is, like, necessarily easy, but that being said, I mean, there's a few extra hoops that you have to jump through um, to get this working on Linux, but I, I remember the Windows install being kind of weird, too. 
you have to get like a, a key file, and there's like a lot of weird kind of semi-sketchy stuff you gotta find kind of online to get this stuff working. Uh, <laughs> these guys are these guys are tenacious, man. I don't know what to do. I just run from them, I guess. Get the hell out of here. Why would she send me here? <laughs> I think it said something about sneaking. <laughs> That's probably why I'm having a hard time. Yeah. Get the uh, what's like Simu hook dot ini or something for the. This actually isn't a Linux thing. This is a this is a Simu thing. If you don't have this thing. Uh, forgot how to fix it. I think it's just a setting in the, in the uh, options menu. Forgot that step. Guys, watch the green screen. I'll get that fixed. Oh, that sucks though. Bizine. <laughs> Clear eyes. Wow. past 100 years. <laughs> the beast. When the beast regains its true power, this world will face its end. Whoa. I think that's going to be about it for this video. I might stream some more of this. Uh, yeah, I just kind of wanted to show you that you can run this. Pretty cool, right? All right. Wow. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Game over. All right. You guys have a good one.